How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Video. Today I want to show you how to reset your iPhone 6 Plus back to factory settings. What you're going to do is come down to the bottom right or look for your settings app. Go to the settings. And then what we want to do is go to general. Okay. Right here. And then we want to come all the way down to the bottom where it says reset. And then we want to tap on the second option that says erase all content and settings. Now, let me explain really quickly. The reason you want to do a factory reset is for one of three reasons. One, you bought the phone and decided that you wanted to get a bigger size or different color, whatever. You always want to reset or erase your data off the phone before you return it because if they forget to return it, your personal information is on there. Now, before you do the full reset, you're also going to want to back it up to iCloud and I have other videos that will show you how to do that. Second reason you'd want to do a factory reset is if you decide to give your phone away to someone else, just give it to them or sell it to them. You do want to take your information off of there because you can't uh, trust people to do that. Some people don't know how to do it. Some people just don't want to do it because they want access to your information. So those are the main two reasons. Um, third reason, um, not too important. We're just going to jump right ahead to erase all content and settings. Tap on there. At the bottom, you will tap erase iPhone. You'll tap it again. And that is it. In some cases, if you did have your iCloud set up, they would ask you to put in that code first. So be aware of that. Sometimes it will prompt an Apple ID password. So make sure you have that information handy. If you have a stolen iPhone and you're trying to do this, um, you're probably going to have trouble because there's safeguards in place. So this may not help you. But for those of you that are resetting your phone because there's a newer phone that's coming out, uh, just make sure you back it up to iCloud first uh, just so all your information is saved. Once you factory reset, it will take all your information off of the phone and it will reset it like brand new. So your information will no longer be on it. It will be essentially a new iPhone again. So just keep that in mind. I hope you guys did find this helpful. Make sure you like, favorite, and share the video if you did find it helpful. Uh, at this point, that line is just going to go all the way to the right. The phone is going to reset and the line is going to go left to right one more time. It will reset again and then you'll know you're finished because the iPhone will have a welcome screen that will be in different languages. So that's how you know the factory reset was successful. If you never get to that screen where they start saying hello in all these different languages, something may have gone wrong. But usually it's a pretty seamless process and nothing tends to happen. So you guys, I hope you found this helpful. Make sure you like, favorite, and share the video. If you did find it helpful, subscribe to HG Tech Videos and have a good one.